Overnight details emerging about a deadly shooting inside this Walmart in Beaver Creek, Ohio, a suburb of Dayton. Police responding to reports of an active shooter with customers running and screaming. Students at nearby Wright State University shaken up. We saw one person getting like gurneyed and getting taken away and then another one not too long after. They could have went to a campus and not a Walmart and it could have been us. A witness posting a chilling account saying the shooter had a backpack and was holding a rifle and that he walked by her as he opened fire. Police confirmed the male suspect injured four people, then turned the gun on himself. Walmart saying we're heartbroken by what's happened. We're working closely with investigators. Uh, the conditions of the victims right now is unknown as they were all transported to area hospitals for treatment. This Walmart has been the scene of gun violence before. Back in 2014, a 22-year-old man holding a BB gun, which was for sale in the store and was out of the box, was shot and killed by a police officer after someone called 911, reporting a suspicious man with a rifle in the store. The victim's family settled a wrongful death lawsuit with the city for $1.7 million. Once again, authorities confirm four people were injured in last night's shooting. The suspect has died. A motive remains unclear, and police have promised another update this morning. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.